Twenty time, daily bread, heavy grind, never try Cause the game's too fake, so it's never mine I'm sick and twisted now, fuck you and your image, it's a gimmick If you ever heard of Pittsburgh, don't visit, pal 95 flow, but I was no hold bar Put the clipper pack in 05, that was my throw Yo, what's going on, world? It's your boy, uh, Don't Flop all fucking day. Set the standard number 10. Make some noise in the building. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
So I guess you could believe that we've been prepping like we mean it. <laughs> we only took this battle because there's a 0.0000001% chance Eminem will see it. <laughs> Boys are quite tight with Royce the Five Nine in the music scene. This might not be at all the right time, but we've always liked Ryan. Introduce us, please. <laughs> <laughs> See, look, you, look, you guys are bitter as fuck. I'm thinking just once, could you cheer the fuck up and start grinning at stuff? Then again, perhaps we can forgive you for the stick in your butts because I'm sure being a rapper up in Michigan's tough. I mean, surround yourself with artists on a million plus. You basically already just admitted you suck. <laughs> Forever going on about knowing Eminem's completely nonsense. I don't even believe you really see him often. So don't listen to his lies or it will feed the problem like giving free adoption to Ian Watkins. Oh. And yet... Oh. Oh. Played out bars, what? And Marv, Marv thinks he's friends with Royce and they're the best of boys until he turns up at his studio in West Detroit and he's like, let's record. And Royce is like, yeah, for sure. I've always got time for you, Mr. Porter, <laughs> Big Herd. Trick, trick. Quest, Quest McCoy. McCoy. <laughs> time, time! Time! Let's go round number one! Time. All right. First round, my request. Let's go. Hey, yo, London, what up? <laughs> I like to apologize again for another lackluster performance. Mm -hmm. And we still waiting on Ilmac, the Saurus. Mm -hmm. But instead we got Marlo and how, how you say it, Shifluti? <laughs> <laughs> Like shuffle. Yeah, okay. But instead right. we got Marlo and Shuffle T. Right, what the fuck, you trying to force it? But, thanks for the free trip, guys. Because the scenery, gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> the pints, they always cold. And you know I love the fish and chips. So I'm out here like a dog catcher, because I'm going to get this bitch. Nah, I'm going to get this bitch. The way y'all biting us with that off and on, y'all seem to be more off than... Mark, on. <laughs> So now we like pneumonia. We own you. We trying to get that coffin. What the fuck? On, we trying to get the coffin on. <laughs> You're not gonna take me serious. Hey look my nigga, I won't lie, I'm just not interested. You think I would give a All fuck? All fucking money are invested? I'm keeping a buck with you, Quest. Uh-huh. I'm honestly not impressed with the people they call good. They already know who the best is. Mm -hmm. Look, Fresco. That's not Fresco. <laughs> Are you sure? Nigga? Yes, bro. <laughs> well, for the duration of this battle, this nigga is going to be fresco. <laughs> well, I'm going to give a pass to his ass like that whack rapper from the Fresh Coast. I'm saying, look at this nigga, though. Wait a minute. Excuse me. All right, man, look, I owe you five pounds. <laughs> he do look like fresco. <laughs> nigga, I fucking told you. You know what? You gotta go back to the old you. You talking about when we killed that caveman cracker in that old you? So true. Oh, yeah. Damn, get money. <laughs> <laughs> you better pay homage. No vintage. We call the shots. My G's prep. I'm E. Baca off the block. Mm. It could buy cream. I off your top. Take half off tea like a hot to top. Mm. I have you talking fast for your life. It's like you working on an auction block. I'm up here sunning these stiffs. Uh -huh. Nigga, I feel like Christopher Walken's pops. Hold up. <laughs> you should kick in this shit, walk in, pop! Nah. I'd rather tie something around his neck and do what? And have him screaming for Christ like he orthodox. <laughs> so y'all smile. Cheese, get your portrait shot. No, 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 y'all don't get it. Just smile. Cheese or get your portrait shot. That's not what I meant. I said I make them run some miles. Cheese or get your portrait shot. See, now that's three ways you can get your poor face shot. Hey, waiter, waiter, I got Trey Pounds. Pour eight shots. Wait, her, wait, her. I got a Trey Pound out of pour eight shots. Fuck this. This. I'm over these niggas' heads like a parade shot. Fuck that. If I'm over this creep head, he'll get his poor age shot. Bang, get money. Box. <laughs> Box. <laughs> that was, that was. Box. That was crazy.
Down two. I really like that bit where you got aggressive and decided to go hood. <laughs> <laughs> and that bit where you said, uh, like, uh, that was so good. <laughs> You said, you said we look like Fresco. That was a shit line. I don't really have a flip for that. But please take off your sunglasses. You're inside. <laughs> because he is blind. Let's go. Stevie Wonder's pretty big yeah, yeah, That's, that's it. <laughs> you called your blog, I am Detroit Hip Hop. Oh yeah, because if I say Detroit Hip Hop, this guy's what you all think of. <laughs> but according... <laughs> according to your bio, you've an attitude to like. Allegedly, way back in school he rhymed. In assembly, he started rapping through some lines about the importance of reading and how it can improve your life. Then, in 2011, 47% of Detroit adults were found functionally illiterate. <laughs> <laughs> it's sad but true, you're fine. Plus, your unemployment rate of all the states is awful, mate. I don't have to prove I'm right, and we can assume that's factored to the stats for brutal crime that are moving rapid through the sky like the Channel Viewer's Guide. Every avenue you find, there's a gangster shooting nine. Now, there's 50,000 Detroit, um, Michigan citizens on average doing time. More than a hand for doing life that probably stand to lose the fight and damn it you can try deny it and dispute the science but this is all single-handedly your fault for delivering a totally basic uninspiring rap when you were nine <laughs> <laughs> I'll take my hat to you, you tried. Now when it comes to battling, face it bro, it's changing, so you need to learn to take a joke. There's a gay battler now. Sorry, his name's Sharon. <laughs> In November, mid-battle, one of our mates proposed and we're helping him pick out the baby's clothes. Because you grew up on battle rap, but it's changed from when you were teens. It's not the same stuff you used to see. Right now, I could get Shuffle to take off his shoe for me, put his face on it stupidly and inhale like he's Scuba Steve. <laughs> yeah! What? What's that? Pricks lose their shit. Don't hate on what you can see, it's the wave of the future. So face it fast. So face it fast, guys, your favourite pastime. Just say, ain't what it used to be. Ain't what it used to be. Now, for those of you who don't know, their history is strange. At the WRCs, they put on a shitty display. It was literally waste. Conveniently, though, Later, the clips of the day mysteriously went missing. Okay. But that's the thing. Okay. <laughs> Stealing videotapes probably used to have his kick in the day, right? <laughs> no, I bet it just isn't the same. So part of the reason Quest and Marv are starting to feel it's getting hard to be part of the scene they rep at heart is because it's harder to steal a memory card. <laughs> <laughs> We're guarding you, Liam. Protect the bars. <laughs> <laughs> the kleptomaniacs been addicted from day. And it's not just videotapes or digital frames, it's 35 mil film cells as well. All Marshall wanted was to put you in his Academy Award winning movie, but you just couldn't help yourself. People think they haven't battled together for three years. They have, they've just been stealing the footage. Believe me, we're looking. <laughs> OMG, you won't believe. They had a two on two at the last event, but they were awful and they cried. So now you'll never see Marvin Quest vs. Thesaurus in daylight. <laughs> you just had to steal the crew from Body Bagnell so we wouldn't see you losing on the channel. Not only did you put Liam through a lot of hassle, but guys, the SD card you stole had the secret Lunar Shotty battle! <laughs> <laughs> but you know, you know they still completely deny stealing those videotapes in 2007. Mm. Let's act this out. No, they even had to go to court to prove what they say. Mm. Let's act this out. I'll be the prosecution and mate, you be their lawyer. I'm Jewish, it's great. <laughs> <laughs> Your Honour, ladies and gentlemen of the jury today, Marvin O'Neill and Kamani Graham <coughs> are accused of the breaking and looting of tapes. Method of concealment? It's true that we face a few different ways. But I've come across indisputable evidence proving that they snuck the item in question through Mr. Graham's missing tooth in his face. <laughs> <laughs> now, if I can direct your attention to the security. <laughs> <laughs> has, has anyone seen my security tapes? <laughs> Uh, Your Honour, my clients felt that they were losing the case and choose if they made to resume in a day. <laughs> Are they guilty or not? They're refusing to say. <laughs> Time! Time!
Bang, bang. <laughs> London, we got a problem. Every time we hear y'all only giving credit to Krug and Er, it's like y'all clowned us. The fact it took this long to get us over here astounds us. <clears throat> Don't flop is an awesome movement shit. We practically found it. It was 07, Jump Off. It was a company called Jump Off. Y'all want to know what happened? Look, look, legally, look, look. our lawyers say that we cannot discuss Jump Off. That's <laughs> <laughs> true. I did, tell, I did tell you. You, did, you literally, you're I did, great. I did. You're a great lawyer. <laughs> but we gave y'all Jump Off a bridge. Mm -hmm. That was cool. That was fresh. Now, we would like for y'all to jump off Tower Bridge with these ropes around your necks. Mm. I remember Jump Off said they had 50K. Hi, Harry. <laughs> but then Jump Off fucked up the church's money. Bye, Harry. <laughs> <laughs> these rappers can never stomach the burden that I carry. That's why these fags is getting smoked like squares. Hi, fairies. <laughs> <laughs> if this was high school, you'd be the geek and you'd be the outcast. We'd be with the cheerleaders worried about ass. You'd be in study hall worried about class. <laughs> I'd walk the halls high-fiving the teachers because I'm popular. <laughs> <laughs> You walk the halls with your head down, getting pushed into the lockers. I'd be homecoming king. We'd never speak. Nigga, we'd never be friends. I didn't even know you exist until I hear about your little plot for revenge. You trying to turn this battle into Columbine? I think not. You'll see the irony when the kid in the coat is the one that's being shot. Oh, that's I would go from flat top to flat top. Mm. I'll flatten that top to that top. With one finger, I will bang on T. It's like the button stuck on my laptop. Mm. You ass, mm. twat, mm. a dummy, mm. a goofy. What else? You a bigger pussy than precious coochie. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all saw the vibe. Y'all saw the vibe. Like Dr. Dre, you'll get beats in front of the crowd. You royalty. I dentist grill if I feel like capping this crown. Hold up, dentist grill, cap, crown. We graduated from students to kings, you uh -huh. know, from the cap to the crowns. Mm -hmm. You can't fuck with me. When I buck and squeeze, I clutch with ease. It looks like you're sucking D's. <laughs> <laughs> you gon' think he trying to say battle. You mean bat uh, when we muffle T. <laughs> Y'all got two options. Mm. <laughs> Get in the bed or have a fight. I'll run up on your ghost in his afterlife, stab it twice. And tell it to get in the fucking bed or have a fight. <laughs> Them pants make you look like a straight faggot. Dyke. A dyke, though. A faggot dyke, though. You can be as nuts as you want, and they wouldn't put this fairy in a straight jacket. Mmm. Uh, Tired. Tired, right? Final round, let's go. Kiss me for wearing pants. That's okay. Fine. Skinny jeans are something they've never had. <laughs> Yeah, you guys are some of the originators. You were the worst of the friggin' lot. Being you guys is like being the Olympic gods of knitting cloths. <laughs> but you know the same. Every dog is meant to have his day. You guys been doing this a while. We don't forget that that's the case, but you've been around so long, no one wants to ever trust your name. So you've, all you've really ever acquired is this fucking pension plan of praise. <laughs> and in the old days, Quest carried you through, Marvin. That's right. He'd always drop a few punches, Punch. then look to you, wanting you to contribute something, and yeah. it's like, Q shrugging. Plus, you have a huge stomach, so the move's tough, and there's really no easy way of you budging. There's an actual jump-off battle where this dude slumped on a stool mumbling while this guy's <laughs> bobbing all over the place like cool runnings. <laughs> Moth, you're like a dickhead at a theme park that approves cutting. You just watch Q jump in and do nothing. <laughs> so now you guys are here. For some reason. <laughs> that you haven't been on lately. 
You came out to the UK and nobody cared. You're battling's Tom Daly. <laughs> you guys, you guys are so forgotten now. People who still know about you, show off that they know about you. What you know about uh, Marvin Quest? Hmm? No. <laughs> <laughs> they were only the battle rap architects. <laughs> what? They only went and influenced Mr. Kanye West. <laughs> Personally, I quite like that dialect. Yeah, if you're into post-2007 neo-scripted bars, then yes. <laughs> The chance of half of them having already heard of Marvin Quest is about as likely as you two knowing Martin Kemp. Or Gasman Depp. Or Arthur Dent. Or Garlic Bread. Or, or Martin Spence. Or Father Ted. Or Wagon Wheels. <laughs> Why do you do that? <laughs> Take the last event. We're by, 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 by far the best partners yet. We make Ark and Steph look like they're hardly met. But Marvin Quest... <laughs> Marvin Quest... Never seen a chemistry so harshly stretched since the Thanksgiving right before your father left. Ah, oh, hi, yes. <laughs> Poor Mark. He still believes the reasons for why his dad would have to go. Damn, how long does it take to grab a pack of smokes? <laughs> <laughs> My dad is back at home. Our environment. <laughs> Our environmental upbringings, based on social and economic circumstance, probably really differ. Ah! <laughs> You've seen robberies, thieves, and triggers. We made broccoli trees at dinner. <laughs> In your battles, you go on about how weapons are good. That is literally the oldest trick that's left in the book. <laughs> Doing that to us is stupid. You're not getting us shook. The only person you'd be shooting is yourself in the foot. I had a gun once. Had a plastic circle of ten caps. I had a gun once. Shot a red flag that said bang. I had a gun. <laughs> I had a gun once. Shot water on my pet cat. I had a gun once. When pheasant hunting in Penzance. <laughs> Text, son, and I don't think I'll get one. I mean, the fact that I could hurt someone is pretty messed up. Plus, I'd probably shoot myself in the flipping leg, bruv, like that awesome scene in Eight Mile that didn't get cut. <laughs> you settle your differences with guns and violence. We settle our differences with hugs and crying. <laughs> You're all about Repping the crazy streets, collecting and making green weapons and bays for free and Mexican strains of weed. And I don't care if your Bentley was made for speed or your Benz has amazing seats. My Fiesta from 83 gets me from A to B. Question <laughs> Marv. Question Marv. In the UK, don't expect respect from bars. You need to go home to get it. Like Brent's guitar. So now. <laughs> so now you're getting stretched apart by Jeffrey Dahmer and Genghis Khan. Couple black jokes on stage. Kevin Hart could get a laugh just by saying Question Marv. Your career's flopped. It's a week before your pension starts and you've made your marks as friends of stars. Best regards. Now get the fuck back to America and don't expect an Xmas card. But you will be getting a present, Marv. A t-shirt that says I'm with dental scars. In extra, 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 medium. Time! Not time! Not time! Not time, unfortunately. Not time, unfortunately. Theo. Yes, sir. each other five years ago in Farnborough's West End. <laughs> we met each other five years ago in Farnborough's West End. Good. <laughs> we met each other five years ago in Farnborough's West End. We were, go we were dreaming of being on Don't Flop and being able to set trends. <laughs> and since that day, our friendship has only managed to extend. <laughs> this is hard for me. <laughs> so this is for, this is for every bar you didn't like, but we kept them. 
This is for when the weight of our shoulders made our neck bend. <laughs> I'll still be there for you, man. I love you. Sean. Even when our rep ends. <laughs> so please, will you be my super duper forever? These no gives back. These best friends. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Tom. Round number three. Let's go. <laughs> 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 Yo, this is an expensive battle. You know how we wage war. So, it wouldn't be right if we ain't give them the Marvin Quest that they paid for. Mm. I heard your bitch is your flatmate. I'll fuck her until you got a flatmate. <laughs> <laughs> She's easy on the eyes and the pockets. She let us all fuck for a flat rate. <laughs> When it's that time she hit my line, the cold word is snack cake. <laughs> snack cake? What the fuck is snack that? cake. It's, it's the reverse Oreo. That's when she take them white titties and smash them on his black face. <laughs> You're a faggot, but act straight. Every time you watch porn, he lactates. <laughs> More! What? More, more niggas have taken turns in you than in a crack safe. <laughs> more middle fingers have been on your ass than a backspace. <laughs> more ball juice has been in your grill. I don't condone this line. <laughs> than <In> patch face. <laughs> Y'all grease up gerbils. Grease them. Shh. What? <laughs> shove, <laughs> shove them up each other's asses and call it a rat race. <laughs> Y'all give, <laughs> give a whole new meaning to sack chase. I'm thoroughly offended that you actually know how that man's sack tastes. <laughs> Your mom go to bed in a Hulk Hogan rip-off t-shirt and a back brace. <laughs> She's a real American. <laughs> and she carries a gun. And she got an airbrush fanny pack with a flag on it and an eagle with the words, these colors don't run. <laughs> Your pops got a tramp stamp on his lower lumbar that says, we come for fun. <laughs> and a tattoo where his mustache should be <laughs> that says, the party has just <laughs> <laughs> hey, let's do some bad bars. All right, fuck it, get real. Mm. You're gonna think that I put RoboCop on his ass. How? When I make him sit still. <laughs> We're like an overweight Trevor Weller. What's that? A big deal. <laughs> I will take your pregnant canine and sit it on top of an eagle. <laughs> and tell it what? And tell it what? And tell that bitch chill! <laughs> and she a tip drill. She a tip drill. You guys are like hamburgers made of ground up children. Well, what would that be? A kid's meal! <laughs> Now nah, fuck that. You know what? I'm oh, sick. <laughs> Bad bars is something you gotta deal with. Fuck that. You two ain't big enough bodies. So her the next time we come over here, it better be for <coughs> DNA. Charlie. What's my man name? I want the fat Joker star nigga. Nice. I'll take C baby. <laughs> I'll take C major or motherfucking shoddy. Bring them bodies. Bring the bodies. Mm -hmm. Do you mind? We up. Let's go. Let's go.